In today's video, we're figuring out what happens if we do a ruined run after completing the final boss battle in Harmony Island. Yes, you guys, everybody, I'm going to be doing another run in Harmony Island, but this time, I'm going to be seeing what happens after we defeat the Ancient One, right? You guys have probably defeated the Ancient One, and if you have, you guys might have quit, right? But in this video, we're going to be seeing what happens if anything happens, right? So let's get this started. If you head up over here, guys, you can see the magical power crystal has summoned itself. So let's click on it and let's teleport across. Alright guys, so over here, as you guys can see, I've selected ourselves a worthy opponent. Right now, our worthy opponent over here is currently the Keeper, right? Now you guys can tell, basically, I'm gonna be like just heading into battle against this guy and seeing how well my pet team does. Bam! Here we go, we're spawning in with our Flyger, and we just have to do some exploring, defeat the boss, and whoa, what was that? Anyways, let's continue on going forward, and our first monster appears. Right, so unfortunately we can't sneak past this, but we can always instantly terminate it, right? Six, ten thousand health that will only take two attacks. Alright guys, we only need to cast one more attack before both monsters are destroyed, so that will be pretty nice, and let me just get straight to that now. Hey, yeah, let's cast the cell, let's cast the spell Supernova onto our foes. Oh no, we've answered our question correct and now we must deal with another attack from the enemy team. Well, only, we only took 3000 damage, so that's fortunate, they don't do a lot of damage right now. Aha, uh -huh, here we go, I've answered the question correct and let's cast our spell, which will be able to terminate both pets on the enemy team and we just need to keep on heading forward. Alright, there we go, and now guys, if you don't know, I have started a gaming channel known as One Doctor Genius Gaming, and basically on this channel, I will be posting some quality gaming videos, so guys, go check out that channel, I'm going to be starting to post more videos on that, and let's see if we can get this to 1000 subscribers in like 2 or 3 months, that will be pretty cool if you guys ask me. Now let's just collect this stuff, open the chest, and continue on forward. Now guys, if you aren't aware, there are certain ways to skip certain monster battles while doing Harmony Island Ruin Run. Right now, let me just quickly attack these monsters quickly. Alright guys, let's cast our epic attack, which should do approximately like 6 to 7,000 damage to both pets. So there you guys go, 7,000 damage done to both pets, meaning will take me like 2 supernovas to destroy them all. Right, let me quickly just do that. Oh no, oh, they've casted their spell on top of us and done 4,000 damage? Alright, that is a lot of damage and now I need to heal up, this is unfair. Alright guys, here we go, I've just managed to answer another question correct, and now if everything goes too well, we should be able to do like maybe 7,000 damage to both monsters, so I will be able to one-shot both of them, and seems like we did 6,000 damage, that's okay, but I'll still be able to one-shot both of them. Oh no, they've casted their spell doing 3,000 damage to my pets, and I do realize that my flame grub would be more beneficial up front, but meh, let's just continue going forward. Kapow! Here we go, another spell casted, another 6,000 damage dealt within a fraction of a second. You know, Prodigy should have an achievement for how much damage you can deal in like a second. Like, there should be some sort of achievement, like, deal 10,000 total damage in Prodigy, right? That would be a pretty cool achievement if you guys ask me. And here we go, another spell has been casted, another 6,000 damage done, and the Squally has been destroyed. And now let's collect our stuff and go through the green crystals right let's just collect this over here boom now let's unlock the chest and it seems like we got a hundred gold and uh, an earth potion right now we got a team earth resist potion now let's continue moving on forward and over here you guys can see we're left with two choices the easy mode or the hard mode crystal now i'm gonna go with the easy mode because we do get healed up so let's just click on that and bam now me and my pets are gonna be restored to full health in a second right shapawi here we are we are in um, Harmony Island, and now our pet's health has been fully restored, so we can continue going along the, the way over here, right? Let's just go on the side, ignore that monster battle, because you guys know there is a way to skip that guy, and that's by going around him, right? Here you guys go, bam, I just skipped that entire battle. I did not do a single battle in the game, and there you guys go, boom. I'm straight to the crystal, it was that easy. Let's just click on it and continue on forward. Alright, let's keep on going forward, do 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 do, um, we can head down from under, not from under, so let's just keep going from over, yes, they are shortcuts, let's just follow the shortcut, head around the side over here, completely ignore that monster battle, and I am pretty sure the crystals are on top over there, right? So we managed to skip one monster battle, we just have to battle this monster over here, and then head on forward. Nani? 
I did not get healed. What? Oh no, this isn't good. My character hasn't healed at all. Well, let's just take a healing potion, which will help us a lot, although the pets will do a decent amount of damage. Let's cast the spell, um, Hot Snow, and it will do approximately a couple thousand damage, so that will be pretty cool. Alright guys, here we go! Question has been answered correctly, we're casting our spell, and it should do 6,000 damage to both pets, so we'll be able to, like, one-tap them after this, right? Yeah, there you guys, let's go. 6,000 damage done, and we just need to one-shot them. It's pretty simple. Right now, I do remember I'm using two attack bonuses and a health bonus just for my wizard over here. So yeah, that's the thing now. I'm gonna like heal my character up quickly. Bam! 10,000 health straight away and it seems like how rude. These people are casting spells on my pets. And oh no, oh no, oh wow, wow. How much health did our flame girl just survive by? How much health did our flame girl just survive by? Because that looks like it was almost dead, right? Bam! Here we go, we're casting our spell and getting revenge back for the Flamegur, which we got in Prodigy, right? So let's cast our spell and hopefully we'll be able to defeat both Luminexes and move on to the next stage. And obviously, what what do I mean by hopefully? We're obviously going to beat them and continue on moving forward. Right, you won, woohoo, let's keep on going. Alright guys, let's click on the crystal and go through it. Alright guys, here we go, we're on the final stage of Harmony Island, and now basically what we have to do is we basically have to search for the monster and basically battle this guy. Right, so here we go, the monster has spotted us, and let's head into a battle. Shablawi, here we go, our health, has been full, uh, our health has been fully healed from Prodigy, and now we should be able to defeat this monster with ease, right? Alright guys, so Magmishes have... So Magmaship has come forward and casted a spell Hot Snow which did approximately 7,000 damage and 6,000 damage to all of the monsters which is pretty decent if you guys ask me because now I will be able to one tap these monsters so I'm just gonna switch over to my Flame Girl and cast a fire spell, right? Let's switch over to our pet. Now I do think this has enough health to stand their attack, right? It has 9,000 health so this should be able to survive. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it will be able to survive. Now let's cast the spell Wildfire. Dun dun dun! Da, da, da. Here we guys go, I just got myself another accomplishment, achievement, whatever you call it. And now, let's cast our spell exactly similar to Hot Snow on top of the entire enemy team. And why is it that Magmischief's attack looks completely similar to the Flamegirl's attack? But that's pretty nice either way, because we managed to finish off the entire team. And now we will be able to find out what happens in Prodigy after you complete another run of Harmony Island after this, right? So let's collect our extra damage bonus and continue on moving forward. Alright guys, so there we go. Now all we have to do is we basically have to find the crystal which will teleport us home. So let's head down over here and found it. Alright, we just need to reach it. Ooh, slight diversion. Let's see, there's a chest over here, so let's collect the stuff from it and then continue back on our way. Right, seems like we got 36 coins. Not a fan of that, but let's keep on going. And guys, do you notice all of these symbols found across Prodigy, these ancient ruins over here? Well, yeah, I guess you guys can figure out what they mean. I am... So far, Prodigy hasn't told us if these things mean anything, but we'll find out sooner or later, right? So let's click on that crystal and get teleported home and see what happens, right? Here we go, we're being teleported, and... Bam! Here we go, we're back over here, and let's see if a candle has lit. Right, bam! And there is no candle lit. Oh, well, that was unfortunate. Seems like you can do as many runs after you after you defeated your trial. Although no candles will lit, you won't get any prizes. Honestly, it would be cool if Prodigy would give us like a certain amount of gold for completing all six trials again. But unfortunately, that doesn't seem like what Prodigy did. So yeah, that's the thing. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys found this video conclusive and figured out what happens after you do another run in Harmony Island. After that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, and give this video a thumbs up if you guys haven't already. And I will be catching you all next time. One Doctor G's out the house. Bye and have a good time.